Okay, guys. Hi, we are back. Caleb Work here with the continuation of Rusty Lake of Cube Escape Case 23. So let's get into it. The chapel. I like this part of it because it's got like a lot of riddles and puzzles and whatnot. Ooh. Gary. The nice thing about all these puzzles is that they are not hard at all. You know, for the most part. There will be a more difficult one in a bit. But we don't have to worry about that for now. Okay, so middle. Oh. Top. Let's try that. Okay, I wonder if I can still move that. Alright, let's see what else we got. A rotating thing. Nope. Um, Detective Dale Vandermeer is in the process of getting edumacated. is not is no ordinary cube that is a golden cube one we have not seen yet oh it's this guy grab that one four eight cool one one two four all right Um, I don't know where for sure all of these go, but I did that pretty good that first time. Cool. Alright, look at here. Oh, oh. I'm sorry, little, little baby. That did not make any sense. I know. Yeah, I know that that's what all of you guys are, are thinking right now. And none of this makes sense. That's just that's just how it is on this game. All right. So first one is that. All right. Cool. Then. I eagle frowny face. I huh? All right, and the last one is Jim closed eyes. All right, cool. I got the show now. Guys, open that. Now we're going to have to do my least favorite part of this particular room. It's one of these things. <sighs> so annoying. And impossible. And impossibly impossible. Alright, so I know that this thing goes here, I think. I 
Alright. Hold on, these go. I get the feeling that this one is wrong too. And that one. Nope, that can't be right. Yes, this may take me a while to do. That ain't right either. Tricky to see which ones are correct. Alright, so I do think that one's in the middle. Or maybe that is in the right spot. That one's on the wrong side now. gonna get it eventually. Okay, good. Those two are right. Uh, oh, I got it. I got it. Look at that. Then this lady. Remember her? That's why I suggested you go to the other room, Caden. Alright, and she gave us that cube. Alright, so take that, place it here. Click on the smoke, or the, the little dots. It took me a while to figure out that, that they're supposed to be clicking where the dots are. Alright. Alright, so we want to go this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, and this way. Click him and he comes over to us. Don't worry, he's nice. He's not going to attack. See? He's still nice, don't worry. It's just Mr. Crow. Gently, the old crow and I sailed to a small island in the middle of the lake. Without a word, the crow left me wondering what to do. Alright, this is the only part of, of Case 23 that I don't enjoy. It's time. You have to go as fast as possible. Yep.
Faster kill, faster kill, faster. Faster, faster. Go, 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 go. Yes. I did it. First try. The end. Finally, I reached the lake. I could not feel my body anymore. The time felt different to me. Like I did not only live like I did not only live that moment, but also my past. All my memories, captured in little cubes, floating around the lake. And that's the end of this. And since we got some time left, let's do Cubescape the Mill. Now this is going to be the next game. In this game, we're going to be playing as that crow guy that you saw from the last game. Settings. Reset. I remember this time. Play. You have to start in the living room. Creaking sound though. All right, let's see. Mm. Yeah. All right. So what we gotta do? This is balance the teeth like. It's like two of these. It's like that. They're all black because they added up to two on both sides. For this one, ten, six, four, five, five. You already took my teeth. What else do you want from me? It's gone. Where'd it go? It's a magic trick. Let me just pick up this liquid gold with my bare hands. And put it in that. Let it instantly solidify into a golden key. But here's the funny thing about that. See, place, it, place this in here. Oh, okay, never mind. You can pick it up. Right, but still. Unlock that into here. Hey look it's Harvey. Bird poop. Thank you Harvey. Hello. It's the it's the woman. What? Hello. This is me talking when I say hello. This is Detective Gail Vandermeer. Perhaps this phone call sounds familiar? It should. Yes. Is this Rusty Lake? Fate. Wait. I am sorry. Your flesh is already escaping. And then it goes away after that. Mr. Crow, the corrupted souls are still wandering the lake. I might have found the one that can stop them. If you can find the two cubes, I will give you Storm. You can bring him to the cabin. Yours sincerely, Mr. Owl. Okay, at this point, you're probably one asking for a bit of explanation. I am Mr. Crow, this guy. The guy that turned into a crow in the last game. Um, the corrupted souls, those are the black things that we've seen so far. Their memories have been extracted by the machine thing you saw at the bottom floor. 
um, to power something or other, or feed the lake or whatever it says. But it causes the dead bodies to turn into corrupted souls, which are kind of like murderous things. And he, when it says he, that's talking about Dale Vandermeer, the detective guy that I have that I've been in the previous games. All right. Soil not fertile. Well, now it is. Dear Mr. Crow, remember the Lake Desire's fresh memories. I will send you the body of the young woman later this month. Use the machine wisely. Extracting painful memories could cause corruption of the body. Yours sincerely, Mr. Owl. Alright, grab that. Here you go. Alright. So at this point, I'm going to start writing stuff down again. Because this is going to be important. Okay. Um... So, flag, square, butterfly, it's hard to draw butterflies, and empty crosshair. And the combination is crosshair, square, triangle flag, square, butterfly, empty crosshair all right so, so first is the crosshair and then it's the square then the flag square again butterfly crosshair I've got milk now Cool. Mm. Do you want milk? I can only imagine what she's saying to me. Pan with hot milk. Do you want that? Okay, fine. Let me shave you then. Mm. That's what you get. And then, because this game is weird. Stick that there. Now I've made wool from my poor wife's hair. Here. What do you want? I know Comprende. Something out there, but we don't have eyesight to see it. We don't have the time either. Oh, knitting needles, cool. And a monocular. Alright. One, three, eight, four. Let's go down. It's a ducky. Go get it. Go eat that whatever it is. Go eat it. Oh, you're getting big duck. Oh, you're getting big, you little ducky. That duck. Isn't that just horrible? So I can pick up molten gold, but I can't pick that up. Real realistic. Okay, so let's give those needles to her. Mm. Warm milk. Okay, you got it. Ding! And I'm going to have to call this the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then don't forget to leave a like and a subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Caleb Borg is out.